everybody, this is Teacher Evelyn saying good morning, good afternoon, and good evening wherever you are in the world. Today, we're going to talk about so, because, and because of. Okay, so at least we know exactly when to use them, and that is our objective for today. So at the end of this um, video, you should at least have an idea when to use so, because, or because of. Alright, let's start with because of. So because of is used when you're just giving um, like a phrase or a noun. It's not followed by a sentence. So let's say, for example, because of that, I am going home early. Or I went home because of headache. Or I couldn't sleep because of the noise from my neighbors. If we say because, because is giving again reason, but this time because is followed by a full sentence. Again, because is followed by a full sentence. Let's say for example, I will study hard because I need to pass an IELTS test. Okay, how about so? So is giving us reason. So let's say, for example, uh, my body was really, really painful last night, so I didn't go out. Or let's say, for instance, we need to plant a lot of uh, trees, so we are not going to experience any severe flooding. All right. Or we can invert this too. I need to see my dentist because I've been experiencing toothache. So you use because. Now let's reverse. I've been experiencing toothaches, so I have to see my dentist. Okay? That is how you use your so. Because is also different. And of course, because of is when you are using just a phrase or a word to complete your idea. So because is followed by a sentence, but because of is followed by a phrase, right? Once again, this is Teacher Evelyn saying good morning, good afternoon, and good evening wherever you are in the world. Ciao.